Putting aside screens. How do you listen? Do you listen with your projections, through your projection, through your ambitions, desires, fears, anxieties, through hearing only what you want to hear, only what will be satisfactory, what will gratify, what will give comfort, what will for the moment alleviate your suffering? If you listen through the screen of your desires, then you obviously listen to your own voice. You are listening to your own desires. And is there any other form of listening? Is it not important to find out how to listen, not only to what is being said, but to everything? To the noise in the streets, to the chatter of birds, to the noise of the tram car, to the restless sea, to the voice of your husband, to your wife, to your friends, to the cry of a baby. Listening has importance only when one is not projecting one's own desires through which one listens. Can one put aside all these screens through which we listen and really listen?